Hey guys, it's Abby, and today I have the Ipsy Open Studios for October 2021. I am so excited to see what's in the box because I don't know what's in the box this month at all. I haven't opened it, I haven't looked at it, and I haven't looked at spoilers, and um, I don't even think I picked my products for this past month. I don't remember, but... No, I didn't pick my products because I my bags and box usually are better when I don't pick my products. It's a little weird, right? This is Open Studios. I do get this sent to me every month for review, and I'm very thankful for it. If you don't know what Ipsy is, it's a beauty subscription, and they have three subscriptions. They have the Glam Bag, which is $13 a month. You get five sample size products, and you get to choose one product that goes in your bag. You get a cute little themed bag. Every month, it's like a little makeup bag. Then there is the Plus, and it's $28 a month. The price did just go up from 25 to 28, and you get five full-size products, and you also get to choose three of those products that go in your bag. And then they have the Glam Bag X, which is $55 every three months. And they do a really good job on that box. I've been super happy. Here is the Ipsy Open Studios box. I am feeling a little awkward, and that is not something that is not normal on my channel. I am awkward, and I am weird, and you know, that's all I can say about that. But I haven't been recording very often, so that's probably why I feel super awkward. My family is getting over COVID. Thankfully, everyone is getting over it. I'm so, so thankful that it wasn't as bad as some of the cases out there. I'm just so grateful for that. My kids start back to school next week. So grateful for that. And my husband is, he's still sick, but he's not super, super sick. So just very, 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 just very, very grateful for that. So I will be recording more and putting up more videos for you guys this month. Sorry about last month. I'm so sorry. Okay, let's begin. Okay, so here is a card and the theme this month is Pretty Wicked. Fangs out, lipstick on. This month, embrace the unconventional, vampy lips, rich shadows, pitch black manis, and you just might vent. You might just vaunt. Vant? <laughs> you might just vaunt some more. So here is the theme, and we'll see. What did we get? Okay. So the bag this month is, oh, look. What is this? What is it? What is this used for? Is it a kerchief for your hair? I don't know. I would probably put this on like a bureau or a dresser or something to like fancy it up a little bit or is it like a pocket thing you put it on your pocket wrap it around your neck I don't know but I mean I'm happy about it uh, I don't mind getting something fancy and cute okay so here is the bag this month it's actually super duper cute it's very on trend for Halloween and I really like it I love the black I love the green green's my favorite color and the look at the little zipper hold on there we go. It's a lipstick. Isn't that super cute? Love it so, so much. Okay. Wow, this is packed. Packed. Okay, so the first thing I'm pulling out is this. And this is an eye primer by M2U New York City. So it looks like this. And it seems like it's just like one of those doe foot applicator primers. I have not used this before. If you've used this, let me know if you like it. I'm not a big eyeshadow primer person. I put like concealer or foundation on my eyes when I'm doing my concealer and foundation and I kind of just leave it there. Sometimes I'll set my eyes after that, but I don't usually grab eyeshadow primer. I should though. I know that the Gerard Cosmetics primer for your eyes is supposedly really good and I want to get that because Just Ann tells me about it all the time. Okay, so here is the primer for your eyes. It is a doe foot applicator and is it clear or is it oh okay it is a color and it will give you a nice little base for your it's not tacky at all it actually feels kind of powdery um for your eyes okay next thing is this and this is the tatcha the dewy skin cream Ooh, so this is a face moisturizer i really like getting tatcha products I do. I like to get them all the time. I have not used this one. It's a light lavender. Really pretty. I do really like the Tatcha face moisturizer that is in like a mint green. 
little jar like this. I love that one, so I'm really excited to try this. Okay, how many products? Two. All right, the next thing is this, and this is Doctors Gold Fadden MD Solution Doctor Scrub Ruby Crystal Microderm Exfoliator. It's a daily face exfoliator, so there we go. Not mad at that. Then we have this, and this is a Farah. It's in the shade, oh, it's a matte liquid lipstick in the shade Coco. Okay, it's really pretty. It looks perfect for fall. So let's open her up. Ooh, that was a good pull. Okay, so we have one of the flat doe foot applicators. It looks like there's a lot of product in this, in this, because when you take off the cap, it is just, it's pretty big. <laughs> it's pretty big. Um, so I am, oh, it's nice and thin. I love a good thin um, liquid lipstick because that means it's not going to like become cakey. And that's really pretty. That's a perfect fall shade. I will totally wear that and I will enjoy it. Okay. And the last but not least is this. Oh, ooh. I got a Viseart palette. This might not be for the glam bag, like I said. Maybe this was supposed to be in my glam bag instead, but I am so excited about this. Okay, so here is the palette. You guys, I love Viseart shadows so, so much. This is the Petite Pro Un, UN. I love these. They're out when they're on sale in Sephora or Ulta, I am all over them because I love their shadows. I really love their shadows. I don't have this one. Ooh, I am so excited. I'm so excited. I'm like a kid at the candy shop right now. Here, let's real quick peel this off. Perfect. And oh my goodness gracious. You guys, I'm so excited about this. This is so pretty. I will wear this every day. You guys know I love, sh I'm wearing shades like this right now. How pretty is that? It's gorgeous. It is so beautiful. I am so excited. Okay, let's swatch because I need to put my fingers in it. If there was one eyeshadow company that I had to use for the rest of my life, it would be Viseart. They always work really well. They don't swatch great, but they blend really, really well and they stay on forever. I don't use eyeshadow primer and I never have an issue with my eyeshadow fading. They are, they just blend so easily and so nicely. Oh, I'm so excited about this. I had no idea this was going to be in the bag or box. Whatever one it's in, I don't care. I'm so happy. I wonder, because I didn't choose my products, if I'll get one. Here is the palette, you guys. It is so beautiful. This with this. You, I can totally see the look. Oh, that's gorgeous. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited about this. Yes. Let me know if you like Viseart shadows. I love them so much. Okay, the Glam Bag Plus bag this month looks like this. It's just a little duffel bag, drawstring bag. And normally I am not a big fan of these because I don't use them. Um, I give them to my kids, but I don't typically use them. But I love this little theme this month and I think I'll give these to, I'll give both of these bags, one to each of my kid one to each of my kids so they can like, you know, take them to school or something during the month of Halloween. So I am really, it's really cute. It's just a cute bag this month. Okay. So I, the first thing in here is this, this is, this works 24 hour skin solutions in transit, rose water and mint infuse pads, gently remove makeup and daily pollution. And there's 12 pads in this. So this could have been for the glam bag rather than the Viseart, but either way, this is something you can get in your bag or box. Okay, the next thing is this, and this is the Dermalect Self-Esteem Beauty Sleep Serum. 
And this is a potent yet gentle anti-aging serum combining three active forms of amino acids. Overnight treatment effectively revitalizes dull-looking skin. Focus on fine lines, wrinkling, and large pores. Gentle for age spots and uneven skin tone. And multitasking facial and decolletage, decolletage or decolletage applications. Asorbic acid. Okay. I like getting, I like getting serums. I just don't like getting a serum every month because I don't go through them very fast because I don't go through one serum in a month, you know? So... Sometimes I feel like they're going to waste and they'll eventually go bad. That's why I'm not opening it and like looking at it. Okay, wait a minute, I got another serum? I got another serum, this is the Butter. <laughs> it is vitamin C, your daily dose of brightening antioxidants. Okay. Get a more radiant and smoother complexion with our pro, pro, our pro, 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 pro Terry, proprietary. Oh my goodness. Don't click out, please. I know I can't read, but I promise you, you'll miss me. Mix of retexturizing vitamin C and antioxidant rich formula combined with the right amount of vitamins to revitalize your skin and improve the appearance of dark spots. So you just apply four to five drops to freshly cleanse and dry skin. So, okay, we have two serums. Didn't I just tell you guys, well, it's one or I, I don't like getting a serum every month. I got two. Okay, the next thing is this, and this is the Murad Renewing Eye Cream. I do like this. I feel like I can never get enough eye creams, but I have like 700 of them. And this is actually really good. Murad is quite expensive, so I do like getting it in my box. So I am excited about that. Okay, the next thing is this. And this is a Sugar Rush by Tarte Easy on the Eyes Clay Liner. It includes a built-in sharpener and it's black. So here we go. Um, Sugar Rush, why did Tarte make another comp like another line? Like why did they make Sugar Rush? It's 16 hour wear, waterproof, smudge proof, and ophthalmologist tested. You know what I mean? Like I know Tarte is their own company, but why are they doing a Sugar Rush like sister company kind of thing? Because I don't know. Okay, so this you screw up the top from the bottom. And then you can sharpen it with this little sharpener. I don't mind getting eyeliners. I just wish that we got more than... A di I wish we got different colors. You know what I mean? You know what I mean, Jelly Bean? There we go. A for Abby. All right, so we got this, and the last but not least is this, and this is the Il Maquillage Icon High Volume and Intense Curl Mascara. I think I've used this before, and I don't think I'm like a huge fan, but I'm not like, it's not terrible, it's just not the best mascara. It's high volume and intense, I said that already. Smell test, it smells like mascara, and there is the wand. Maybe I don't have this. The wand does not look familiar. I don't know. The wand doesn't look familiar, but I could be wrong. All right. So this was my fifth or sixth product. I don't remember. I think I got six products. I think they accidentally gave me two serums, to be honest. So for the month of October, 2021, you can get the Il Maquillage Full Size Mascara, the Smudge Proof Sugar Rush by Tarte Eyeliner, the Murad Renewing Eye Cream, the this works makeup removers, the Dermalect serum, the butta, it definitely says butta, B-U-T-T-A-H. The butta vitamin C serum. You can also get in your glam bag the eye the eye primer by MTU New York City NYC. Um, the matte liquid lipstick by Farah, which I am really excited about this shade. It does not dry down. I mean, it does transfer. So that's something to note if you don't like a lipstick that transfers. I don't mind as long as it's comfortable. So we got this in the shade Coco. It's really pretty. We got the Golden Fat, the Gold Fatten Face Exfoliator. The Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream for Your Face. Super excited about that. And 
the Viseart eyeshadow palette, which is my favorite thing in the entire box. This is just amazing. I'm so excited about this. It's so pretty, and I can't wait to add it to my collection. You guys, that is just so pretty. And something that I will wear all the time. Like, I will wear this all the time. Really excited about this. So, so excited. And I think that is it that I showed you guys for the products. And here are the bags this month. Adorable. And the theme is pretty wicked for October 2021. Let me know what you guys thought about this month's Open Studios. Do you like the spoilers? What did you pick for your glam bag and for your plus? Let me know in the comments below. And that is it for today, guys. Thanks for hanging out with me. Thanks for watching me stumble through reading and being super awkward today. I'm trying to get back into things. And um, you guys know how I am. I am a mess all the time. So, all right, guys, that is it for today. Thanks for hanging out with me. I appreciate you guys so, so much. I love you guys so much. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.